You are more like your mother than you think. Your power should have revealed my intention, Takahashi Takeda. No doubt Genshi taught you how to use them. My father taught me a lot, Grandmaster. Let us see. Your father, not yet. Huh? Damn it. You announced your arrival, Jacqueline Briggs. Specialist Briggs. Yes, military decorum is important in your family. If you know my father, you know me. Thought you and he were friends. Our history share a dark chapter. Judge yourself harshly, Specialist Briggs. rather than mock your superiors. I'll remember that, in case I ever meet one. Oh, my God. 
false bravado does not suit you. Any ideas? Sub-Zero, let's talk. That opportunity has passed. Got a new plan, Cage? You could have followed the old one, Jin. You're gonna catch hell if you kill us. Yes, I suppose so. Chuo, Tang Jin. That worked? This was all a, a... A training exercise. Damn, I should have seen it. You and your friends show much promise, Cassandra Cage. But until you function as one, you will fall short. So other than that, you enjoyed your visit? The Lin Kuei shredded us. You, maybe. I see plenty of frozen boot prints on your ass, too. Come on now. You're all winners in my book. New orders from General Blade. Priority one, Outworlders. Here in Earthrealm. An invasion? Couldn't be. You're not afraid, are you, Mr. Cage? Outworlders, I can handle. So when did they show up? The portal opened by the docks a few hours ago. Nearly 5,000 in all. Refugees from the Outworld Civil War. Must be bad if they risk coming to Earthrealm. After you. Do not dwell on your encounter with the Lin Kuei, son. It's pretty hard not to. Thanks, Kenshi. Could you and Mr. Cage join us? Sergeant Cage, you and your team as you were. This is Li Mei. She seeks asylum for her people in Earthrealm. Our village, Sando, was the epicenter of a fierce battle. We barely escaped with our lives. Such is war. I mean, no offense, but you outworlders kind of live for that, right? This was different. The rebels, Melina, had a weapon unlike anything. Entire battalions erased. It was not honorable, not combat. Tell me more about the weapon. A talisman, gold, with a center jewel. Melina wields its crimson energy without precision. Well, that's good then. Not now, Sergeant Cage. It is enough that she possesses it. It turns the tide in her favor. The Emperor grows desperate, and those caught in the middle pay the price. If this talisman is what I suspect it to be, we may all pay a price. We talking about Shinnok's amulet? Can't be. The base, the vault, your wardings. SF, Shaolin, no way anyone can get past all that. I must be certain. Well, this is cozy. You remind me of an Earthrealmer who crossed over with us. He also found humor in everything. Handsome guy, right? He was an Earthrealmer. One of his eyes glowed red. What does she mean? Kenshi, continue with Lee Mei. I'm going to the refugee camp. Gotta get to him before he finds a way out. I'll come with. Go get an update on camp security from Colonel Flagg. Why? Because then you won't be here. Are we with you? No. I need to confirm with Kotal Khan that Lee Mei's story is true. You and your team are going to Outworld.
I don't know. I expected the sky to be purple or something. Don't believe everything you see online. And what makes you an expert? The Shaolin Archives. I studied a lot about Outworld. No substitute for experience. So what makes you our leader? Guys, let's stick to the mission. Li Mei has to be telling the truth. An invasion would violate the Reiko Accords. Because you can always trust an Outworlder. But if Outworlds are ally, why didn't they help us during the Netherrealm War? Against Quan Chi and his team of... Revenants? Like Jackie's dad? Asshole. It's not an alliance. Not an aggression pact. Outworld is not our ally. A point you might make with more subtlety, given your surroundings. Now state your business, including a reason why we shouldn't kill you. I can read you. You're not from Outworld. I'm from Earthrealm, like you. But my employer, Kotal Khan, is from Outworld. So now I'm from Outworld. State your business. We're emissaries. We need to talk to Kotal Khan. Here, we have Raiden's official seal. I can buy one of those at that stall right over there. Look, you can arrest us, even kill us. But if we're telling the truth, you probably get a pay cut. Or worse. You take us to the con, I'll tell them you took us down. Maybe you get a bonus. You can't lose. Follow me. In these times of war, we are required to view every resource as a weapon for our Emperor to use at his discretion. To take without his leave is to steal from the hand of Kotal Khan himself. Therefore, having been found guilty of theft, you shall be put to death. I was hungry. Your sentence will be carried out immediately. Death? For petty theft? Remember where you are. Jin? I shouldn't have listened to you. A lesson in trust from a mercenary. Here's another learning opportunity. is the best of them. I'm a quick learner. Let's 
play, Tor. <laughs> you couldn't just ask for a pony like every other girl? The archives never mention symbiotes. Love to learn more about you. Too bad you're insane. You guys all right? <laughs> the Earth Bombers, yes. This one must learn more of your diplomatic techniques. We're here to see Kotal Khan, General Blaze. You interfere with outworld matters. The penalty is death. I'm sensing a theme. But, as we honor the Rako Accords, we will consult the Emperor. You will await him here. You want to take this opportunity to tell us what the fuck shit you were thinking? I gotta wonder why you'd risk inter-realm war for a bread thief. Because not all thieves are irredeemable. It has more sentimental than monetary value. Nevertheless, I would prefer you did not steal it. 
It's a family heirloom, one that shouldn't have been given to you. Your family honored me with this memento of your cousin Lao, after his death. A death you caused! You made him fight Shao Kahn, and stood there while that bastard snapped his neck! You go too far, Kung Jin. No, not far enough. <laughs> <laughs> Let me go. Blood of Kung Lao, descendant of the great Kung Lao, a common thief. Did you think you could walk unimpeded into my temple and walk out again without my complicity? You wanted me to attack you. Why? To release your anger, make you amenable to reason. Make me feel like shit. Self-loathing has always been an unfortunate part of your makeup. There lies ahead a brighter path. One that will truly honor your ancestors. One that is worthy of you. Go to the Wuxi Academy. Join the Shaolin. Like Kung Lao before you. I can't. They won't accept. They care only about what is in your heart. Not whom your heart desires. It's too late for me. It is never too late, Kung Jin. Your news of refugees is troubling. Their exodus to Earthrealm was not known to me. I do know this. I invited no guests from Earthrealm. Certainly none who would disrupt the execution of justice. How do I know you are not allied with Melina? Perhaps her newfound power has earned her new friends. Friends? No. No, we're not even sure that Shinnok's amulet she has- She employs Shinnok's amulet against me? The very item Earthrealm swore would be safe in its care? When Outworld was offered no participation? We were under attack, not Outworld. Odal Khan, the fire that burns the sun. We are here because we share your concerns about the missing item. 
We intend no ill against your rule. At least one Earthrealmer can forge words like silver. But I recall an Earthrealm expression. There is more honor among thieves than diplomats. I've had the questionable fortune to be both Emperor, but I'm telling you the truth. You are allied with Melina. You may carry out your sentence. Kotal Khan, under outworld law, I claim the right of defense by combat. What? You're gonna fight a duel? To absolve us of all accusations. Denying the request brings dishonor upon the accuser. You know much of Outworld. No, also, the duel ends in death. You have won nothing. Merely a few more seconds of breath. <laughs> Now, Emperor? The charges against you are void. I say to all that Earth Realm means outworld no harm. Now kill me. Be done with it. You're not actually gonna. Instead of your life, I claim your service. Melina does have the amulet. We can get it from her more easily if we work together. Emperor, they cannot be trusted. Thora, can you not perceive? I am indebted to them. You honor us, Kotal Khan. Our gratitude is wide like the ocean. I'll talk to General Blade. Tell her about our new... Arrangement. Thanks for the heads up, Sergeant. Stay with Kotal Khan. We'll figure out next steps once I've got Kano locked down. Yes, ma'am. Cage out. He's still here. I can feel it.
Report. One of the refugees found her near the north perimeter. That's one of Kano's neckties. Inform Lee May. Tell her we're investigating. Raiden, what'd you find? Shinnok's amulet has been stolen, replaced by an exquisite duplicate. Damn it. Something is wrong. I will speak to you once I... Raiden? Raiden! Lieutenant, I need you to take a team to Fort Charles. Check in with Raiden and report back. What's going on? What's your update from Colonel Flagg? He said, why are you bothering me? And I said, because my ex-wife is a pain in it. Where are you going? You can't just walk away. I'm in this too. Not my decision. Thank your buddy, Secretary Blake. This is what split us up in the first place. You disappear in your work. Never time for me and Cassie. I had responsibilities. Sorry you couldn't be the center of attention. There was a time when you cared more about your family than your job, General. Nope. No evil sorcerers in here. Would you get serious? Quan Chi needs to clean up his man cave. It's cleaner than yours. You're comparing me to Quan Chi? Only in terms of cleanliness. This. I wouldn't do that. Ah, oh, come on. Where's your sense of adventure? You wish for adventure? You shall have it. Fire! I have no need of your soldiers, but you and Mr. Cage will serve me well, once you are dead. Don't know when to quit, do you?
Not as tough as you look. Quan Chi, you've lost. A delay, Miss Blade. The inevitable still beckons. Johnny! This will not happen. Gotcha! I still got it. Sorry, Jax. I'll get you out of here. You'll be fine. Don't know. Blood's supposed to be on the inside. Raiden! I must reverse his spell. It's working! Essen Salta! Penta! You cannot save him. <laughs> Thunder God, Johnny Cage is mine. No, he's mine. Save him. 
I've got this son of a bitch. That wasn't even close to what you deserve. Sonia Blade, the link with Quan Chi is not completely severed. Not a problem. The others are restored to the living. By coupling Quan Chi's dark magics to my own, I was able to restore their souls. Is he gonna make it? Haven't I told you? Uh, he's a god. Huh. You scared the shit out of me. <laughs> and they said I couldn't do horror films. <laughs> He's gone? How did he... We gotta go after him. He can wait. Right now, we need to get you and the others back to Earthrealm. Why is it taking so long? Name. Rayen Edu Keire. Thanks. All right. You Thank seem you. to know this Kano intimately. Not the word I'd use, but yes. I chased him for years until he escaped to Outworld after Shinnok's invasion. Why would he return now? All that matters is he's... ...caught. Gotcha. Are you lost? Hello, love. Been a while. Not long enough. This is General Blade. I need MPs to my location immediately. 
Oh, let's keep this between friends. A trade. Info for freedom. I don't negotiate with scumbags. Well then, if mother won't play nice, maybe daughter will. If you ever. Back off, and all's well. Piss me off, and Cassie's gonna meet Uncle Kano. I swear to God, I'll kill you. <laughs> I swear to God, I'll kill you. I swear to God, I'll kill you. No gain. No, 
I'm not done with you. Alright. Alright. Get off me. Sonia, ease up. You kill me. Never fight. Amulet. Move, move, move. Sonia, we need that info. Sonia, don't make this another thing you regret. Talk. The Quatan jungle, with at least two divisions of Tarkatans. They're on the move constantly to avoid detection. That's not far. Maybe 200 kilometers. You know what to do. Yes, ma'am. Good luck. Blade out. You have new information? From Earthrealm? Kano talked. Gave us the details on Melina's location. She has the amulet, but she's got a lot of protection. We will strike immediately. Perhaps a two-pronged approach. The army will engage Melina, distract her, while this one retrieves the amulet. Not alone. This one's coming with. Still is of the essence. Did you not hear me? You may assist in the main strike. Cora, we will grant their request. And I will finally be rid of Melina. This one understands your logic, but does not reach the same conclusion. Like others, this one is not pleased with Melina as color. But it is not clear your crew will succeed. That is why I invited our Zaterran friend. Listen, and join us. I know things about Melina. Her troubled rule will fall in the telling, and pave the way for Quatal. What would you know that... <laughs> There they are. Three of your fellow counselors, whispering like handmaidens. About what, I wonder? If only you would hear our counsel. As war with Netherrealm looms, I have urged detente with Earthrealm. And I've told you I would sooner die than treat with my father's murderers! You refuse practical solutions to credible threats. You endanger the realm. And sedition does not? Speak your last, before I have your tongue. You are not Shao Kahn's true heir. She is a construct, formed in Shang Tsung's flesh pits. I saw this. Your best claim to the throne is moot. How dare you! I succeed Shao Kahn by his decree! Succeed him you have, but Outworld demands new leadership. From you, Arshtek fool. Kill him! This one serves Nelina no longer! Uh, ah! You will defend your Empress! Our creator Shao Kahn is dead. We will serve whom we choose. <laughs> Still, you found Melina. Shao Kahn conquered my realm. I owe him my loyalty. I honor his will. <laughs> <laughs> 